this is Mike Haber. Thanks for asking me, can I get bond on a probation violation or a VOP in Florida? As with many things in the law, the answer is, it depends. There is no right to bond when you've been accused of a probation violation. Further, judges routinely deny bond to probation violators for a variety of reasons. For example, they may simply want to sweat you or make a later plea more likely or send a message to other people on probation. And one could theoretically sit in jail for months on end waiting for a VOP hearing. Still, anything is possible, and your odds at a favorable outcome will exponentially increase with the assistance of a skilled and experienced criminal defense lawyer efforting on your behalf. VOPs or violations of probation start by your probation officer swearing out an affidavit, which claims that you either failed to do something that you were required to do, or that you did something that you were not supposed to do while you were on probation. A judge then reviews that affidavit to determine whether or not a probation warrant should issue, and if so, then whether or not a bond will be set. This decision, to attach a bond or not on a VOP warrant, is 100% discretionary with the judge, and 999 out of 1,000 times the answer is going to be no, and you will have a no bond hold on your probation warrant. Since 99% of probation warrants have no provision for bond, if you're taken into custody on a VOP warrant, then you're going to be booked into the jail, sent over for your initial appearance, and then held in custody until you are brought before your presiding judge, the one who issued the warrant. Note, if you happen to get taken into custody in another county or in another state, then you're likely going to sit and wait for extradition, and that could take weeks. But still, your lawyer can apply to your judge for bond on a VOP warrant at any time. Just remember that unlike the situation with a new substantive arrest, you have no right to bond, not constitutional, not statutory, not by rule, when it comes to a VOP hold. That said, I thank you very much for your question. I appreciate your having asked it, and I invite you to ask me more. Please remember that at Haber PA, it's all about reasonable doubt. And if you like this video, then please subscribe to our YouTube channel. We'll be putting out more soon.